Hello friends, welcome to this session. Uh, if you are an agile enthusiast, I'm sure you are going to get a good value from this session. And you will be pleased to know that we are organizing a Discuss Agile conference on 15th and 16th of December, sponsored by Eisenbridge Consultancy Private Limited. And it's actually a multi-theme conference and it has themes namely personal agility, hybrid agile, Kanban, and uh, coaching leadership. And there's other uh, topic as well for which we have with us uh, Vishal, who is going to talk about um, Scrum anti-pattern. So before we go into the topic, uh, over to you Vishal, please introduce yourself uh, to our friends. Sure. Uh, thanks, Jatinder. And first of all, I would like to thank Discuss Agile team for giving me this opportunity to uh, present my talk on Scrum Entry Patterns to this conference, which is happening in Bangalore in uh, December. So uh, myself, uh, Vishal Saxena, and I am a Scrum coach uh, based out of Hyderabad. Uh, my, job, my job as an Scrum coach uh, involves helping uh, the uh, organizations to achieve uh, their business goals and helping teams um, uh, to become high-performing, self-organized, self-managed uh, when they implement a Scrum. And uh, uh, coaching individuals and also coaching individuals on Agile values and principle. I started my journey uh, in Agile world five years back when I heard the concept of uh, servant leadership, and uh, which is very close to my heart. and. I'm amazed to see uh, uh, in those five years, like how this agile uh, culture brings the uh, or recognizes the human uh, values uh, at the workplace. Thank you very much, Vishal. Now, uh, I would like to ask you that what your talk is all about and what kind of takeaways that people can take and apply back to their business. Yeah, sure. So I'm very excited to uh, present my talk on Scrum Anti Patterns, and I have organized this talk around uh, five Scrum ceremonies and their respective anti patterns. So we have daily Scrum, we have backlog grooming, we have uh, sprint planning and execution, and uh, sprint review and retrospective. So I'll be talking about the uh, actual purpose of these ceremonies and. Uh, how to conduct those ceremonies in an effective manner and all sort of anti patterns uh, which exist in those ceremonies and uh, i will also give the possible approaches or techniques to eliminate those anti patterns from these ceremonies so what happens initially anti patterns looks like a very good idea and when team members applies uh, that idea that idea gets implemented in Scrum practices, it backfires badly. And you may, may, may or may not be uh, seeing uh, the consequences uh, immediately, but very soon you start observing those uh, uh, consequences and it affects uh, the team to achieve their goal and also it affects the organization to achieve their uh, uh, business goal or the vision or the strategy which they have set for the team, uh, you know, to, yeah. So, and the key takeaway from this session is to get familiarized with those anti patterns and the techniques which you can apply at your workplace to eliminate from these ceremonies. And how you can apply the three pillars of Scrum, uh, which is transparency, uh, inspect, and adapt in all these ceremonies. Right? So I have compiled the list of anti patterns based on my experience uh, coaching multiple teams in different organizations. And I will be bringing the real time or the ground, real time experience and the ground reality or challenges to the participants. And this session is going to be a very interactive session, which uh, I would, in which I would like to learn from the participants if they have the similar anti pattern, what are the techniques they have applied. Uh, right? So this, will, this is going to be a co learning session. Great to know, Vishal. So this is a very, very real use case. I'm sure audience and our friends are going to get lots of value because once we apply Agile, there are lots of pitfalls. It's the organizational culture which actually takes over. Now, how do you deal with that culture? How do you make it happen in a way so that it is effective? 
this is what Vishal is going to talk about some anti patterns, some pitfalls, and then how do you address them? And Vishal is also going to talk about the three pillars of Scrum, which is inspect, adapt, and transparency. Thank you very much, Vishal. We are actually looking forward to learn and understand from you how do you how do we handle the real use cases and how do we address them. Thank you very much, Vishal. See you, uh, friends, uh, on 15th and 16th of December in Discus uh, Agile Conference organized by Eisenbridge Private Consultancy. Bye-bye. Yeah, thank you very much, and I'm very excited to join this conference. Thank you, friends.